Yo, 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 everybody. Welcome back to being on a budget and uh, being poor. Uh, last episode, you, you noticed I had no audio going, which is uh, ultimate sadness. That was a big L from me. Um, I didn't know my microphone was uh, has taken a dump, but here we are, back with SLRR. As you guys saw last time, the car... Uh, the car wasn't good. <laughs> it definitely didn't didn't do too well. But first, no, I want to bring everything back onto the car and see just how much it weighs right now. 1,600 kilograms. So um, before, I, before I get right into this, uh, I want to say that this series should have been already on SLR injected 1.4. Um, but here we are, not on it. Uh, this is, I tried installing it yesterday. I had problems. Um, like I said in the, in the other, in the, other video uh, I'm gonna try and get it work get it to work before I leave for vacation and uh, make a video for you guys but uh, if you if you want a more in-depth explanation of what's what's going on with, with that uh, visit go go check out the uh, uh, the uh, let's play episode fucking 10 no 11 episode 11 uh, that's where all the information is so let's see how much it weighs now. So it shaved 200, 200 kilos out of the car, which is good, I guess. Um, but with this engine, we're not making a lot of power. Uh, but yeah, you know, mm, let's go do a two. Let's go do a slide or two. Let's go do. I, I need a little bit more money before I start building. No, actually, you know what? Let's start building the the. The, the engine because that that's more interesting than driving a very slow car engine let's go into other engines engine block and now we need the re world renowned Dorito uh, if I can find it just block uh, there we go 13b real performance block because we need to be performant uh, crankshaft, I don't know how, how, how cranky, fucking, yep, there we go, blueprinted, what does that mean, which is better, I don't like the idea of a blueprinted one, so I'm gonna buy this one, I don't know if, I don't know if, what, fuck, I don't know if it matters, but whatever, um, engine lid, I guess we do need an engine lid, okay, these parts are fairly, fairly, uh, cheap, for now, obviously, uh, I really enjoy that. So pistons, we obviously don't have pistons, but we might have. There we go. High compression rotors for 256. Man, this engine is gonna come out very cheap. I might be able to build it right right now. I was thinking I would need to go do some drifties more, but either way, I can sell the other engine. I mean, I will sell it. I don't need it at this point. Um, there we go. Which one is better, peripheral ported or bridge ported? Let's get the peripheral ported, which costs a lot of money. That's a lot of money selling the head, so we need to be, get some uh, can shafts or whatever the fuck the version on the on on the rotaries is. Mazda engine boat. Okay, for twenty one dollars, I'm buying some. Rear and front spark plugs. Okay, that sounds nice. There doesn't seem to be anything else. Let's see. <clears throat> intake systems. What can we get here? An intake system, probably. We need we need them turbo boys. Um, we actually have an exhaust, so we don't need to do that. Uh, silica. No, we don't need a silica. Twin turbo. Now nah, I'm gonna go single boy because single boys are cooler. Anything else in here? Nope. Also, it's probably gonna be cheaper than to buy two turbos. But can't show. Exhaust systems. Okay, let's see some exhaust systems. Damn. Lots of VR parts, but we don't need none of those. Oh, there we go. There we go. Supercharger. Intake manifold for a turbo setup. So yes, this is what we need. A turbo setup one. Fuel systems. Let's get someone. Let's get a nice fuel system for this car, so it can spray some mad juices. You know, some wild race juices. 
methanol, hydrogen, diesel. I'm gonna get a normal fuel rail because we don't need to be fucking ridiculous. Only a hundred dollars, dude. Fuck, this engine is gonna cost me jack shit, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna be building this engine right, like, like right now. It seems it's a compressor, just um, custom supercharger. For two, I don't have enough money to buy the, the turbocharger. Single turbocharger. I still don't have enough money to buy it, so it's not like fucking. It doesn't matter that much, but interesting. Do I risk it and sell the engine right now? No, I'm gonna go do some laps, man. It's it's not worth it's not worth the risk, you know. It's not worth the the risk if I might not be able to get it all the parts. Like you don't know what will cost a bunch of money out of nowhere. Two laps on Shinjuku ought to do it. Okay, the car I guess feels slightly better. I don't know. We got two grand out of the last last uh, thing, so I am hopeful. I am. I love this non-drift drifting, just fucking understeering left and right. This is so painful. Oh my god, like 60 kilometers. Barely. Well, that was fucking excessive. I barely... I barely fucking hit that. The rear suspension is bent. Is it? I mean, it seems to be, maybe. In theory, it should be, but this game with its fucking ridiculous crash physics, dude, barely fucking tap that shit. And I don't agree that I should have even been close to it. Oh, man. The high speed section. Downshift. Oh, it's very uncontrollable, this car. Like, not that it's uncontrollable, it's just you don't really have any much input. You just gotta be very smooth and very centered. You cannot go to the edges and whatnot. I gotta watch out with those edges, cause that's where that's where everything went or uh, awry for the MX-5. That's what uh, that's where it died. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is the saddest shit I've seen. <laughs> this is not even like I, what am what am I supposed to talk about like how sad my life is right now with this fucking car it's it's oh my god everything everything except the engine is red I need to rebuild the whole goddamn car I need to strengthen the chassis out I guess I don't fucking know what the fuck am I supposed to do there but first we need an engine Nice, nice. Oh, damn, that was some mad angle. I mean, two minutes a lap, dude. This is, this, these would be the, the, the painfulest, the most painful four minutes of your lives, boys. I'm sorry about this, but like, this is, I am sl literally slightly sleepy. Man, it's got, I was on the brakes like wild, man car has bad brakes right now <laughs> to say the least gotta invent invest in some uh, nice breakage because right now we are uh, sad breakage good thing this engine is fucking rock solid that's why I'm so sad because like this engine is so wild a turbo might have been fucking right where it needs to be with the Miata but this four cylinder engine I don't think it will be sufficient for an RX-7, especially since since it's much better to buy a buy a a 13B and just have an, an, an authentic RS7 RX-7. Funnily enough, on my Instagram, I just posted a uh, a RX-7 that I took photos a photo of. So uh, yeah, check out my Instagram. It's a very nice place. It's a very nice place to be. I, I post really cool shit. My my stories are always lit. Always wildly. Uh, oh. Okay. Okay. That, that's the end. The end is near, boys. Don't worry. High speed drifting, third gear drifting. 
the car bogged down there like fucking it died okay two grand more we are we're in the game boys we're in the game we're almost done with the, uh, the 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 build so okay we need to go back into engine other engines we need to go into performance systems i think that the the custom tube supercharger turbocharger is probably better than the not custom one so let's buy the custom one uh transmissions we need a nice a, a nice transmission for the car five speed we i it doesn't matter that it costs the same. I don't. What's the fucking difference, you know? Clutch and flywheel. Let's see what we can do. Here, probably very normal things. I don't think we should be surprised by what kind of clutch and flywheel. Oh, there we go. C custom flywheel. No, that's a stock. We don't need none of that stock shit. Okay, well, where is the. Where is the. Where is the clutch? Uh. Okay, Super V, 2JZ, Torque Inventor, oh fucking fade me, um, Toyota, Toyota, oh shit, clutch disc, what, what is this? Oh, there we go, there we go, how did I miss that, nice. And MISC, I've got $200, yeah, you see, exactly, dude, if, and if I... If, if I had sold the engine, I would not have... No, I would have enough money. Would I have... I don't know, man, at this point. I'm sorry. Goodbye. It, it was nice working with you. Six grand, baby. Oh. Oh, we're... We, oh. We're good. We're definitely good. Because we just barely run out, ran out of money. And uh, to be fair, I don't know if this engine will run immediately. Uh, as uh, engine building in this game is... Uh, you know, it's, it's, like, it's like the... It's like gambling. It's, it's fucking most of the time it doesn't go well. <laughs> um, let's see. Fucking. Oh, the game froze. I hope it hasn't crashed. That would not be fun. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank the Lord. It hasn't crashed. Okay, do we have none, nothing for this car? Oh, there we go. There we go. So, no, we don't need a supercharger belt. We need... Uh, Intake scoop for 36. Let's get an HKS uh, single. Um, blow off. Yeah, sure. Why not? Oil pan, radiator, pulley, drive belt, alternator. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. It's time to build the engine, boys. It's time to build the engine. Or is it? Thank you for watching. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck with you guys. My throat is really hurting right now, so I can't do this anymore. Uh, thank you for watching this episode, and next time we will be finishing up the engine build.